so hey you guys it's still morning time so good morning and i just left a job interview i did not get that job but that's okay though i'm gonna continue to look it was not the time for me to be looking for a job anyway kind of sort of but yeah i'm hoping that the person that gets that job is the job for them and the employer find the person that they need to fit that position that's gonna be good for their company so i just had a topic that was random i'm sitting in walmart parking lot again and i had a topic that is very random just something that was on my mind while i was driving over to walmart and i was like let's talk about that on youtube so getting right into it i want to know what type of friend are you guys like comment below what type of friend you are there's that friend that's going to be honest with you and there's that friend that's going to tell you what you want to hear i'm not the friend to tell you what you want to hear to make you feel good i'm not that friend if you ever came in contact with me i'm going to be honest with you and that's just that i am going to be honest with you i'm that friend i'm that family member whether you want to hear it whether i feel like it may be harsh for you to hear i'm not sparing any feelings because sparing feelings is going to keep you in a situation that you might not need to be in maybe you're not going to change your situation at that time but i'm going you're going to look back and be like well mika told me this i don't look to be right i don't want your situation not to be good but i'm going to tell you the truth from my point of view and i can't say you know from my point of view if i was in your situation that i do what i'm suggesting you to do or you know what you're asking for advice on but i'm going to tell you the truth because i'm a friend you know and i feel like you know i have any time that i'm talking to a friend a family member my most honest people in my life is my man and my dad you know i have you know other people that's honest as well but they're the ones that's just raw and i like for someone to be raw with me because when someone is raw with you maybe it's blurred in your mind what you're talking about what you're thinking about doing and you need that person that's going to tell you the truth I would be the person to tell you the truth. For real. This calm is in our segment today. But, yeah, I'm going to be that friend to tell you the truth. You know, maybe what you're trying to do financially is not for you. You know, I'd be wanting people, maybe I'm looking at it this way, but I'm being very, being naive and just not looking at it the way that it should go or putting too much on me that I can bear. In my other video, I did mention that I failed to start my business. Baby girl, you was moving. You you just knew that that was not the right time, but in this fantasy world, in my mind, it was. So that left me to hurt myself, but you know, from hurt and pain and life lessons, we learn from them. You know, you grow from them. You know not to make those mistakes anymore and yeah be a friend be a real friend don't tell your friend that you know something that they're doing is right and it's not don't tell your friend work that relationship out don't don't do that like tomorrow is not promised to none of us like to none of us day! to this day so how would you feel you know lord forbid something happened to your friend because for instance you're telling them to stick with the relationship that they are being mentally physically abused you know what i'm saying or a relationship that's not helping them grow so how would you feel if something was to happen to your friend and you wasn't being honest with them they could have did something else with their life or you know spent their time they could have got out of that relationship moved forward found someone that was better for them before their time expired on this earth like be honest with your friends live for today tomorrow is not promised so if you're living for today be honest with your friends be a real friend like i'm gonna be a real friend regardless of if i feel like okay this person is gonna be mad at me i don't care i i don't have a care in the world 
not at all because i'd rather be honest with you when you fall out with me and you're gonna realize later that that was what it was be honest with me rather how i receive it be honest with me you know be be a real friend like don't nobody have time for this generational stuff that's going on these fake friends and setting friends up and stuff i'm not that person I'm not going to set you up to benefit me because in the long run, you're going to see that stuff again. Believe it or not, like, I don't be trying to do nothing. Like, I done had my past days where I was like, it is what it is. But no, I don't like nothing to, I don't, I don't want to see nothing. So if you don't do nothing, you won't see it again in your life. And if you do see it, maybe it's just, uh, you know, for you to learn a lesson. But I try to avoid things at all costs. Yep. Tell your friend the truth tell your friend that the pants are too little and she's going to affect her private area because she want to wear too little pants tell your friend she shouldn't be wearing crop tops because don't nobody want to see their skin but the person is laying with her you know be honest with your friend tell your friend don't go out buying stuff that they shouldn't be buying tell your friend you cannot control nobody all you can do is friend you know, do you think that's the best option for you? You know you got to have gas in your car to get to work. You know you and your kid, or even if you don't have kids, you know you got to eat the week. Friend, I would like you to have some money in your pocket. So, don't go over your budget. I love, like, I'm very secretive. Like, if I was more open, you know, I, I would have done better in life. <laughs> But, yeah, I have real-life situations, and I always want somebody in my corner that's going to be honest with me. Yeah, Walmart going to start paying me, or I don't know, how would they go? But, yeah, go to Walmart. I'm going to promote them. <laughs> yeah, they, sh they should start paying me. Yeah, because I stay in Walmart parking lot. Yeah, that makes you want to go to Walmart, don't you? So, yeah, slide that in a little comment box when they asking for suggestions. Put that in that suggestion box to start paying me because I promote them. Because I'm at Walmart and I have something to buy from Walmart. So you go buy something from Walmart. I'm going to be the friend to tell you to go buy something from Walmart only if that can fit in your budget. You know? But yeah, that's what I wanted to talk about. Be a real friend. You know, some people don't accept it for what it is. But if they can't accept your honesty, they're not your friend. I don't care. You know? Who cares about who you lose, you know? More than likely, they want beneficial for you anyway. If you lose them. They weren't meant to be in your life. Who cares? But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and go in Walmart and get what I need because I know I've been here a long time. These people that came out the store for making groceries. And I'm just sitting here wasting gas. See? Somebody should be a friend to tell me, don't be sitting in Walmart trying to record for youtube on your gas and you don't have a job you just run, burning up gas and air running your car for no reason your car is tired of running in walmart parking lot be a friend and tell me but no for real like comment and subscribe comment under this video what type of friend are you